Hello viewer and welcome to the e-learning classroom. So today we want to look at this experiment. So we have a, a plane mirror. The plane mirror is here. We have the plane mirror. We have a glass block. The glass block is here. Then we have uh, the setup, the way it is arranged. So uh, let's do the setup. We first arrange the the setup is as it appears. Remember, our interest is to find the reflective uh, index of the glass block. So we first arrange the setup. We can uh, stick uh, these papers with office pins. Uh, let's stick the plain papers on the soft board. Then we place the we place the glass block. Uh, the glass block uh, on our setup. After that, we now trace the outline of the glass block. We trace the outline of the glass block. We trace the outline of the glass block uh, like that. So we can remove the glass block. You can see the outline now. So from there now, we make the normal NK. We make the normal NK. So that means we can first mark a point here. We can mark a point. Then uh, we measure an angle of 90. We measure an angle of 90 degrees. The angle is there. Then we join the two points. So we have the normal NK. NK. We have the normal NK. Then from there, what we do now, we are going to replace back uh, the glass block. But before that, uh, we can measure the angle. So let's say we work with an angle of 30 degrees. Let's work with an angle of 30 degrees. So uh, let's measure that angle. All angles are measured from normal, so the normal should be at zero. Then we measure that angle, 90 degrees, 30 degrees. 30 degrees is there. So, we have the angle of 30. Then we can prolong this line with the dotted uh, line. We can prolong with the dotted lines like that. So uh, this is point A. And then this is point O. So from there what we do, we replace back the glass block as it was initially. We have to confirm all the signs. We replace back the glass block and then from there, we place the plane mirror. We place back the plane mirror. We are going to use the plasticine to stick the, the plane mirror so that it doesn't move. So let's say I can use the plasticine there. To stick it there.
You have to confirm everything to ensure that nothing moves. So we have replaced back uh, the mirror together with uh, the glass block. So from there now what we do, we mount two pins, pin one and two, on the uh, line AO. So the first pin there. The first pin there, and then the second pin maybe somewhere here. The two pins should have some distance, they should not be very close to each other. The two pins should not be very close to each other. Then, from there, what we do, we look uh, through this side. To locate uh, the two pins such that they are forming one line. So we locate the two pins. So we have the first pin and then the second pin the second pin there so that is after locating the pins as we did previously Let's go back to the setup now. So what we do now from there, we remove uh, the system, we remove these ones. And then we join the two holes with the, a straight line. We join the two holes with a straight line. So let's see. And then we can prolong with the dotted line. Can prolong with a dotted line we have the new line so from there now we draw this normal here draw point y so this is now the point d and this is the height y this height here is t the distance here is t that is uh maybe you can identify this distance from here up to here that is distance t so we are told uh, to measure the length and then to determine the constant k given that k is t over y so let's measure those distances uh, let's measure those distances so that we can see we can measure them from here So T is uh, 6.8 centimeters. This other one is 2. Point, uh, so this other one is uh, 6.8 minus 2.5. 
6.8 minus 2.5. Let's see. I believe you can see it here from there. I don't know whether you're able to see that. May not be very visible. So uh, let's see, that is the distance y. So let's see the values of those measurements. 6.8 minus 2.5. That is 4.3 centimeters. So, constant K is given by T over Y. So, 6.8 centimeters divided by 4.3 centimeters. So, 6.8 divided by 4.3 this one is 1.5814 1.5814 remember the units will cancel out so and that becomes the value that becomes the value of constant k and this k is the refractive index. K is the refractive uh, index of that glass. So that marks the end of uh, that session. I wish you all the best.